To get a concealed carry permit in the state of Wyoming, one of the ways is to take a class taught by an NRA certified instructor, and that is what we offer. So th this class can be just about anything. The, the law is very vague. So each sheriff is, you know, kind of has the, the ability to choose what they will accept. And my understanding is that in Teton County, uh, it is not acceptable to have an NRA instructor meet you at the bar and say, hey, be careful with that gun. Did you enjoy the class I just taught? That's not quite enough. In some places, perhaps it is. There are a number of online courses that I think they're $29 or something like that. You just take the online course and, and it's taught by an NRA certified instructor and then they say, hey, you're good to go. In Teton County, I don't believe that works. And I personally am just not, not good with that. I feel that if I'm gonna put my name on a certificate saying that you are comfortable, that I've observed you being comfortable, familiar, proficient using a firearm, I should actually see that in person. I should know that know that you're you're have that basic understanding of using a gun. So that is why we offer the course in the way that we do. We have always taught one-day classes, and they've ranged anywhere from six to ten hours, depending on how many students and how many questions are asked and that kind of thing. Uh, and we've needed to change things. Uh, because of the response to the, the virus spring of 2020, uh, there are some rules that we have to follow at the venue we use that don't allow people to be within a, a social distance. We have to be beyond that at six feet or ten feet and wearing masks, and it's just not practical, it's not a good learning environment, and so we've had to come up with a, a better or different alternative uh, to, to make do during this time. So we've put a lot of work into developing this course so that you'll still get the same quality or close to the same quality as you did in our traditional classes. And I'm kind of proud of what we've come up with, and while I I say that, I really want you to be in touch with me if there's any por uh, any portion of this course, any parts or pieces that are not great or that I'm incorrect about. There've got to be a few that I've just missed. Please be in touch. Tell me what I got wrong, uh, what we can add to make it better, what was a little bit, you know, we overdid. Uh, give me your feedback. I really want to make this better as time goes on uh, to make it make it a better learning experience for you. private pistol uh, class that everyone seems to love. We, we bring out a number of guns you can try out, and it's just you and one other person if you choose to bring them, another family member, uh, and the two of you with your instructor focus training for two hours. Contact our booking gurus and get that scheduled. it will be with a private instructor, so we do each of those customized as far as time and, and everything, so you'll be in touch with us for those. And those videos consist essentially of the three to three and a half hours of lecture that I typically provided uh, in our traditional classes in a live classroom setting. So I have prepared those on videos, and in some are as short as I think, 10 minutes, and in some are as long as 40 minutes, but you can kind of watch them as you choose at your own pace. It's up to you if you want to do it all in a one afternoon sitting, or if you want to do it over the course of a week or two. So that's at your pace. So I mentioned earlier the legal section. Uh, we are going to be covering laws as they were some years ago in Wyoming. And I purposefully am not trying to be your legal advisor here. I'm, I'm not an attorney. Nothing said in the class should be considered legal advice. Consider everything I said to be wrong and outdated. And it's just a starting point. It, it, it's to let you know, oh, there's a law out there about brandishing firearms. I should check into that. And, and I'll share with you where you can go to find all this information. It is also going to be different depending on the state that you live in. So if you're in Idaho or Montana or some other state that it has the same standards as Wyoming, uh, and there are a number of states that will accept our class as proof of firearms familiarization, those states are going to have different laws. So you'll need to do your own research and figure those out. For those of you that have already taken a class like this, things have changed. The laws have changed. They're constantly changing. Make sure you're checking every single year. And if you want good, true, up-to-date, real good legal advice, go to your attorney that specializes in this. I cannot tell you these things. 
even back when I was a cop, I didn't stay up to date on classes as much as I should have. And I can kind of, you know, without ratting anybody out, neither did my partners. Get your advice from a, an attorney that is really staying up to date on these things. It's going to be worth doing that. So that's a brief description of what the course is about. Uh, if you have any questions, please feel free to reach out, ask me, and uh, I'll get those answered.